Hi, I'm Fred McNew, and you're watching QA TV 7. Have we got a sports special for you? Think for a second. How would you like to run from Western Maryland all the way across the state for something to do over the summer, and especially if it's a great cause? Well, I've got with me Caitlin Adams. Caitlin, thanks a million for stopping by. Thanks for coming by. Now, we're in Centerville, Maryland. Tell me what the heck you're doing. I'm running across Maryland to raise money for amputees who can't afford prosthetics. Now, the whole state. Yeah. Okay. Actually, I had to take the long way because I couldn't run across the Bay Bridge. I didn't okay. want to hold up traffic. Okay, so tell me another look. You started where? I started up in Cumberland, Maryland. Okay, and you're going to end up where? Ocean City. Ocean City. Now, how are you doing? I mean, you every day running what? On average, I'm running about 17 miles a day. Okay. So I just wake up, eat, run, chill out, go to sleep, and do it again. And where do you spend the nights? I mean... Well, I had hotels donate a lot of times. I had to pay for them sometimes. Okay. And now that I'm close to home, I just go home and sleep, so I save money. Okay, now I'm a former runner and a former uh, cross-country coach. Mm. How many pairs of shoes have you gone through? Um, well, I'm using four, so that none You're of rotating. them are... rotating. Yes. You're rotating. Yep, okay. so none of them are too worn out yet, but I've gone going through four pairs. So 17 miles a day in the rain, the hot like today. You've yes. had all these amazing weather, right? Yes, I've experienced all of it. <laughs> now, Caitlin, tell me again. Let's tell everybody... If why are we doing this again? Um, I'm raising money for Limbs for Life, which helps amputees who cannot afford prosthetics. And Limbs for Life helps veterans who lost their limbs. It helps kids who were born without them or people who've gotten in accidents and can't afford to get a prosthetic. So basically to help people walk and run like I enjoy doing. It's great. Now tell me, you have a website and a Facebook page. Tell us, or what, how can they contact you if they want to make a donation? Well, on runacrossmaryland.com you can donate. Uh, we've raised eight, over $18,000 so far. Great. And once we hit 20 20,000, someone else gets a limb. Okay. So far, we've had seven people receive limbs from this. Terrific. Yep. Okay. And then um, you can follow the whole journey on Facebook under uh, Run Across Maryland. There's a page. Now, I have to ask you as an old runner, uh, how many meals are you eating a day? Are you eating five or are you just sticking to your three? I'm just or? eating whenever I'm hungry. Oh, okay, all right. <laughs> I lose Which you're, you're grazing all the yep, time. Yeah, right. I am. Now, how about you've got some, explain to me your support crew and introduce to this young lady right here. Well, every day I have different people following me and running with me. And today, this is my best friend, Addie. She's going into the Naval Academy, leaving in two Addie, weeks. going to Naval Academy. Congratulations. Thank Good you. for you. Now, Thank Addie, you what are you doing to help Caitlin out? Um, I'm just trying to be there for her, and I, I'm running with her today. I'm immensely proud of her. Sure I love to brag on her. It's, okay. it's insane. I'm so, so proud of her. Words can't even describe it. Well, great. So. And you're going to be in the Naval Academy. You're going to be an admiral one day. Yeah, maybe. You can do it. <laughs> now, Caitlin, where did the idea, I mean, did you, would you just wake up one morning and say, hey, look at I would like to, or how did it come kind about? Kind of. Uh, when I was a junior in high school, the word prosthetics popped into my brain for, okay. uh, and it was going through my head for about a week. It sounds crazy. Um, I didn't know what it meant. No one ever said it. I just kept going. You didn't going. know anybody had lost a no. limb? No. Okay. Nope. I, you know, everybody asked that question, but no. Um, so finally I looked up the definition, found out what it was, and that was the first year I started running track. And okay. Now, that's, this is at, where was this? I started at Colonel Richardson. Okay, Colonel Richardson. Before Wayne's I transferred track. to North Carolina. Okay, that's all right. Um, and that's when I realized if I woke up and I didn't have legs, couldn't run. It would change your whole life, right? Yeah, and it's just something that we all take for granted, and it's such a blessing to have two legs, so I think... Everyone deserves that, and I want to help make that happen for those Good. people. Now, were you a cross-country runner, a mile or two mile into an outdoor track? I am it? not a distance runner. Oh, I run the 800. Well, not a, I'm a mid-distance. Mid, I'm middle distance. Yep, I'm an 800 runner, mile runner. So this was definitely a change in my training, and yeah. uh, but. I, I've enjoyed it. I really have. Now, how are you feeling? I mean, you feeling good? Surprisingly, I'm not really sore right now. I just finished off a sprint with her at the end, and All right, okay. I feel great, really. <laughs> now, so and so you're doing 17 miles a day. How about weight loss or anything? I've lost 10 pounds. 10 pounds. Not okay. trying. I've been eating ice cream all the time. Oh, Still good. lost 10 pounds. Yeah, I might do it for the ice cream. <laughs> I That's know. not a bad deal, right? I love it. I don't feel any guilt when I eat it anymore. Grandma, come on in for a second. How about introduce her, okay? This is my Nana. Oh, this is Nana. You she, get right in here. She feeds me. She feeds She feeds Nana. me a lot of food. Nana, what, what are you feeding her? Anything I, that she'll eat. <laughs> Probably everything after 17 miles, right? Yes. <laughs> yep. Now, what day is this? In the, how many days have you done this now? I lost count. Lost I count? believe it's day 23. 20, so this is 23 days nonstop? Um, yes. Well, actually, I have had rest days built in. Okay. Um, but just one day a week. Okay. 
Now, did you think you'd have a grandchild on TV running across the state and doing this great thing? No, I didn't. She, every day she amazes me more. Well, you should be day. very proud. I am. She good. So where are she we now? She's such a kind heart. Well, good. Look, at it's June 16th. So when do you hope to finish? I'm finishing on June 27th at 10:30 okay. in Ocean City. Oh, you got, you're going to be in Ocean City. Oh yeah, right into the ocean. Philadelphia or what? Avenue. We're actually finishing when I hit the boardwalk. Okay. Um, but I'm going to make sure I run into the ocean, so oh, it's all the way nice. to the end. Right. Well, look at I just think what you're doing is delightful. I've been following you on Facebook, so that's review for everybody. First of all, if they want to know more about you and what you're doing, what what the sites they can go to? Go to the Run Across Maryland page on Facebook. It's Maryland spelled out, Run Across Maryland, and then to donate. It's runacrossmaryland.com. Again, Maryland is all spelled out. Okay, so. and then we want to make sure, I promise you, you've got a 5K race or a 10K race coming up. Tell yes. us about that. It's a 5K. You can walk it. You can run it. I don't care what you do, okay. but just come out and support. Um, it's $25 for everybody, unless you're a student. It's only 10 and any support I can get will be very helpful. I'm okay. hoping... I'm sorry. Again. I'm hoping that we break 20,000 that day. So right now, remind everybody where that is, what time, et cetera, et cetera. It's at Easton High School, and okay. it starts at 9 a.m. And you pre-register, get there early? Uh, you can register there, or there. if you go on Facebook, you can find where to register, but okay. you pay there, and, you know. Any non as good food going to be there? Um, I have pasta. Oh, oh, pasta, pasta yeah, yeah. Oh, We'll be there, we'll be there. Well, Kate and gals, I want to thank you both. This is terrific. Good luck at the Naval Academy. Thank you. Good luck whenever your future plans are, okay? Thank you. And let's get everybody to look at. Take a second, go to the websites, go to Facebook, and find out a way you can help this young lady help other people. Caitlin, have a safe run. Thank you. Okay, maybe we might even be in Ocean City that week. We never know. All okay? right. That's All right. Not, be okay. Wonderful. Thank you. This is Fred McNeil. Thanks for being with us. My time's up. We're going to see you next time.